The new Pokemon Scarlet and Violet anime trailer might have given us a huge hint about the plot of the next anime series. At the end we get a brand new poster and I think that they dropped a nuke in terms of a huge plot point in terms of what's to come. You may be thinking it's about Rico's pendant and how it could be linked to the new legendary Pokemon from the Scavio DLC, but you'd be wrong. It could be about Roy's Pokeball and its connection with the shiny Rayquaza. No, this time I want to talk about the airship that you can see in the top right of the poster. I personally think that this is going to give us a huge idea about what's to come next in terms of the anime's plot. Okay, get ready for the prediction game. I think the series is going to start with Liko at school and we can see her sitting alongside what I assume is her friend and she would have just received her Sprigatito. Then at some point she battles a rival, but she gets interrupted by Freed who introduces himself as a Pokemon professor and invites them both to be research assistants. The rival declines, but Liko accepts and at some point so does Roy. I'm not sure since we didn't get any information regarding him, maybe he's a classmate of Liko or he just doesn't attend any school. Well, the airship and all the Pokemon we see by Freed are actually his. For example, I totally see Slugman and Karko using their fire attacks to heat the coal in the ship that allows it to fly. Maybe Metagirls helps with the navigation. All the Pokemon have assigned tasks and it makes sense because he's a professor and they have been known to carry a lot of Pokemon with them. Of course, Captain Pikachu is the leader of the Pokemon on the ship and he runs the show alongside Freed. Another good reason backing up this point is that it would lead to the series being a journey cell exploration where they could use a ship to travel around Paldia and to other regions. I think this makes the most logical sense and can have a protagonist going to any region or any part of Paldia whenever they wanted. Is that the best course of action for the series? Who knows, but it does look like that's the direction they're going with. Do you prefer a traveling series like the original series of the XY, or do you prefer the series remain in a journey style going through different regions in every episode? Maybe even they can have an SM format where they travel with other classmates, maybe like Iono and others. Maybe this girl sitting next to Liko is actually Iono before she became a gym leader since they have the same teeth. Personally, I'd prefer the journey style if they stayed in a specific region for multiple episodes where they solve a plot or find a Terra Crystal or something. Let me know in the comments below your answers, but yeah, what do you think about Freed's airship?